I-14. Now, and you may have noticed there's a lot of green around yep. here today. Green, green, and a little bug over there. There. <laughs> <laughs> you could be a weather person. <laughs> no. Anyway, what, we're going green today because uh, we're supporting organ donation. That's the color the life bank. of the Life Bank color. And uh, there's so much need here in Northeast Ohio. Let's take a look. Harry Boomer shows you how to live to give. Our goal here at Life Bank is to change the culture that, so that donation is a great thing to do. The late Congresswoman Stephanie Tubbs Jones understood that. She donated her organs. We saw immediately following her death, we saw a 500% increase in online registrations. Um, three years later, we're still seeing the effect of that. Gordon Bowen of Life Bank says you don't have to be famous to save a life. It's important because there's currently 112,000 people waiting for a transplant in the United States and about 3,000 right here in Ohio. One organ donor can save eight lives. One organ, eye, and tissue donor can help save up to 50 lives. Think about this. 18 people a day die waiting for an organ. Well, the corneas are used to restore sight. Um, and then bone and skin are used for burn victims or people who have maybe some kind of bo uh, bone deformity. And then the organs themselves most of those are life-saving. Frankly speaking, a lot of people are afraid to register for fear doctors will let them die to get their organs. Bowen says that nothing could be further from the truth. They have an ethical oath to, to save lives. And once that decision has been made that their life cannot be saved, then we are contacted after that fact. More donors are needed, especially from among African Americans and Latinos. He has a part of me. Damien needed a kidney to stay alive. Deadly toxins had destroyed his kidneys. For a normal person with functioning kidneys, it's uh, usually below one. And at the time mine was discovered, it was in the, the mid-20s. If I could have done it that day, I would have. Thanks to his older brother, Carlos, Damien gets a new lease on life. He's just stepped in and just gave of himself and took himself down to just having one kidney uh, so his brother could go on and raise his family. There's a lot of people on the waiting list don't even know that they can get a, a transplant, a living wow. transplant. Dr. Charles Modlin, a kidney transplant specialist at the Cleveland Clinic, performed Damien's surgery. He says blacks develop kidney disease four to six times more than whites. It's easy to become a potential donor. Just sign up when you get your driver's license or go to www.lifebank.org. Harry Boomer, 19 Action News. Okay, 517.